Hello, people of the internet. My name is Queen Audrey, and welcome to Bendy in the Dark Revival. Like I said, we are now the queen. This is our- Oh, wait, we can actually sit. Hold on. I didn't know. This is nice. I could get used to this. Anyways, unfortunately, we do have things we need to attend to, and one of those things include includes actually leaving this place. At least I think. I don't really know. Ah, oh, what's this? Surely, this will bring us somewhere else. I think. It sounds like that came from that direction, so I'm guessing it opened the giant door. Hello? Uh, excuse me? What is going on here? Oh! <laughs> oh! 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 Oh my god! Oh! 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 No! Oh! 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 Honestly? I could get used to this lifestyle. Oh my god, look at this. <laughs> we have so much stuff. We only need two more of the, um, these little kit things, and then we can actually upgrade our gen pipe again. I shall go for now, but hopefully you'll see me again, because, I mean, if I keep getting riches like that, you sure as hell bet I'm staying. Ooh. I'll see you. No, thank you. I think I'm just going to hang out in my little community in the sewers. <laughs> um, okay, here we go. I also want to find... Bendy. Ooh, okay, that's just a fan shadow. I also want to find Bendy, because I don't want him to be mad at me. We saw him a bit last time. Ooh. Damn, look at the city. How big is this place? <gasps> Bendy! Oh, it's you. Where did you come from? Yeah, where did Look, you? The door. I'm sorry about earlier. I, I didn't mean to hurt you. And I really don't think you want to hurt me either, right? No. Good. Let's be friends then, okay? What do you say? You and me? Yes! Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for the old gent building. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Is oh. it a bad place? It's okay. I won't let anything happen to you. We'll go one step at a time. Just you and me. Let's see what we can find. <laughs> Look at him. He's so happy. Chapter 4, Factory of Horrors. Wow, we're making a lot of progress. I feel like Chapter 1 just like <laughs> was so long, and then we we're burning through these last three. All right. Well, hey, Bendy. Hi, buddy. Oh, my best friend. All right, let's not waste a battery because we do have our pipe fully charged up. Anything? Oh. oh, he like follows me around. That's so... Oh my God, he's so adorable. <laughs> All right, let's head out this way. Hmm. Street exit. Okay. Bendy, you coming? No. Bendy, we, <laughs> we have to leave. Okay, well, he, he'll catch up, I bet. Nothing in the trash. Ooh, some batteries. Hello. You made it. Okay, you're just gonna keep sitting on the benches. <laughs> Toon Garden, New Flesh, Studio East, Stoneshire, Little Deck, and Death Lake. Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> these are great names. Oh, my God. Look at this. Look at the moon, too. There's a full moon down here. I hear someone singing. Oh, nice. You want some chips, Bendy? Bendy, where'd you go? Bendy, do you want some chips? Uh, I'll find you some chips. Look at this place. It's so awesome. <laughs> Bendy. In temptation. Now playing everywhere. That's you, buddy. <laughs> That's you. Okay. Ooh, wait. Some more slugs. Okay. Grand chop. Oh, hello, Meatly. How you doing? All right, then. Um, I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go. There's a lot of different buildings. What's this? For Betty. Oh, is Betty the one singing? Wait, I really want to meet Betty. Where is she? Not in there. Uh, <laughs> stop sitting around, Bendy. Probably in here, right? Inspect. 
It looks like we need to find an ID card somewhere around here. Any ideas, Bendy? <laughs> Don't tell me you just have one lying around. Oh no. Find an ID card. Okay, so they're probably gonna be in some of these big gent crates. Never mind. Trolled. Oh my god! He helps you find, like, little, little things. Eugene Lloyd, the future has arrived. I just didn't know it would get here so soon. Some of the stuff that's coming out of Gent doesn't really follow any of the rules of physics that I know. Hard to believe they started as a bricklaying company once upon a time. Nowadays, we all have the modern conveniences and, worse yet, the headaches. Take that ID card machine they've got at the door. You don't bring your ID, you ain't getting to work. So I started putting my ID card on my nightstand in my room at the Downside Hotel. It's not the safest place, but at least I know where it is. Looks like we found a clue. <laughs> All right, so the motel was down somewhere. What? What? Oh yeah. I'll just start my own place. <laughs> what the hell? I I'm not your problem. Bendy, get him. No, what are you doing? Stop <laughs> treading carefully. Get him. Keep keep the safe uh the street safe. Uh, can I go in here? Hmm. The beef is people. Oh, wonderful. Okay. Thanks for the loot. I don't really want to eat the beef. Oh, wow. Okay, so there's someone else down there. Okay. Um. Bendy! You're not following me! Help! Got him. Honestly deserved if you didn't see me in your uh, peripherals. Hurry up! <laughs> Come on. We need to find the hotel. Here it is. You gonna point out another... No, you just want to sit down. Audio. Steve. Oh, this is a long one. It's my first week in the job at the Gen Workshop, and I can tell already that this is going to be interesting. Do you think you can lift this steel gutter? They asked me with a smug smile. <laughs> I didn't even bother to answer. I just picked the whole thing up with one hand. <laughs> you should have seen the wee men drop their jaws. Uh, aye. Not on all. I've noticed this building just isn't built for someone my size. Every time I walk by the workshop shelves all the tools fall to the floor. That, and I gotta bend down for every doorway in the place. <laughs> Still, there are some positives to working here. I mean, take that new secretary. The shy wee one with the blonde locks. The one who follows her in, Mr. Grey. Mm hmm. I'm pretty sure she's been giving me and my muscles the eye. Fine, no smooth talker. A work born man such as myself ain't got no business with a woman that fine. Shoot your shot, Steve. You never know. I mean, she probably does if she's, you know, shooting you and your muscles the eye. Oh, yeah? That's weird that he's pointing to it. I'm going to keep knocking. Um, what? I can't, I can't knock anymore. I'm guessing that was an Easter egg of some kind. Uh, all right, Bendy, I can't knock anymore, bro. Let's just go see Betty. Because I'm assuming this is where we're going to see her. That's locked. Ooh. Aha. Whoa. Nice. Whole bunch of stuff. I don't think I need a heal. Bendy, you wait down there, bud. Oh, there's another hole. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Oh, here we go. Use my cord. That's it? That's kind of underwhelming. Okay, that's also locked. Oh, this is just his room, I guess. <laughs> Hello, Boris. Kablamo. Here's his card. Well, geez, you haven't gotten far. Don't do that. Wait. Bruh. How? 
How did you get in here? Oh, I have my way. It's just a memory. So tell me, how goes the journey? Slow, but I'll get through. <laughs> ah, I see you have your father's never quit go getter spirit. Oh, now you knew my father. Well, newsflash, I didn't even know my father. Oh, Joey's her father, mother, isn't he? Or anyone else I'm calling it. I see then. You've chosen to forget the past. I can understand that. <sighs> what are you talking about? Look, I don't think you're ready for this. But hang on to your lunch money. There's something I want to show you. Wait. <laughs> Never good what hearing that line from Joey. There's something I want to show you. I wonder if he's actually her father. I feel like they, they wouldn't drop a line like that unless you're going to lower drop something. All right, Joey. Joey. I'm here. I'm Wait, here. what? Let's see what we can find. What? Wait. This is... Wait, 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 wait. Over here. Come have a seat. This won't take long. Um. Wait, how far back can you go? Wait, this is chapter one Bendy, bro. Can I see the ink machine? You can hear him back there. Oh, damn it. You can hear him. Oh my god, what? Dude, this is amazing. So this is the aftermath of the first chapter where like all the buildings collapsed. Oh my god. This is so awesome. Okay, seems like none of the doors open. So let's go talk to Joey, I guess. Okay. Death. Uh, ooh. Another illusion of living book. Hello, Joey. Um, sit. Okay. Where are we? Very old place. Full of memories. <laughs> but never mind all that. There's a little story you need to hear. You ready? Here we go. Once upon a time, Audrey, there was a bitter old man who had lost just about everything. Joey. Right. The real Joe Drew. Hmm. He blamed everyone but himself for his mistakes, but mostly he blamed his old business partner Henry. for abandoning their work years and years ago. A man by the name of Henry Stein. Stein. Great artist and a good friend. In his anger, Joey used an evil machine to create another world. Wow, just huge lore drops. He'd torment his own version of Henry forevermore. Yep, trapped him in the cycle. One day, a miracle happened. An angel came into Joe's life. A young woman by the name of Allison Pendle. She didn't visit often. But when she did, she saw something good in Joey no one else could. <laughs> including himself. Through their friendship, he began to see the world with better eyes. So one day... In Joey's cartoon cycle of hatred, he gave Henry an angel of his own to guide him when things were most dark. Oh, wow. To always provide hope. It was then Joey decided to make something new. Something he had always wanted, but he could never have. A family. But not a cartoon one. Something real. And after many, many tries, he created something that made him happier than he ever could have imagined. A wonderful, loving daughter. Bright, and kind. Audrey. Almost human. Oh. He created you. I Audrey. knew it. What? Are you crazy? Listen, I know it's a lot to believe. Who do you think you are? I wasn't born from some machine. Flesh and, and blood. I'm not some kind of ink monster. Just because we're born of darkness doesn't mean we belong to it. We're always free to choose. To believe what we want to believe. Take me back. Right now. I'm not listening to any more of your lies. Remember, 
who you are, Audrey. Leave me alone! <sighs> Wow. It's not true. It can't be. I mean, definitely could be. <laughs> definitely, definitely could be. I mean, it was laid out pretty clearly, in my opinion. I'm not shocked. Um, I know in one of a, the previous videos, there was a line that... Uh, I think the ink demon said and there, there was also been like so many hints of like the faces in the ink being like you belong to us like you're one of us so it makes sense I I understand um bendy I just want to listen to Wilson where the hell am I? Oh boy, this seems far away. It is a little bit. This isn't gonna bode so well for me. Wow! <laughs> okay. Yeah, they both got alerted. Wow, that is unfortunate. I was hoping to find some chips. <laughs> I might just run past them all. Put it in, Audrey, come on. Oh, damn it. Oh, going, going, going. Running, running. She doesn't crouch. Where's Bendy? Is he okay? Ooh, this looks interesting. What's this? I don't like how everyone's hanging. Oh! Um. Whoa. What? Oh. Wait. Did he, like, crouch down and die? I don't think that was my Bendy. I refuse to believe that was my Bendy. He wouldn't... He wouldn't be like that. But what the hell? They, like, turned on rainbow colors. They, <laughs> they put on a neon show. Um... Oh, you're... <laughs> oh my god. Bro, what? What is this place? Where am I? Was that supposed to happen? I don't... Wait. <laughs> I'm so lost. Where am I? I can upgrade my pipe. The shock pipe. Shock- Ooh, this looks epic! Unleash the power of the punch. Use the shock pipe to launch a devastating series of heavy hits against your foes. Use tab to activate it. Okay. Yeah, looks good. Oh, that- that opened. Okay. Archie. Paid to die by Archie Carter. Let's have a listen. I don't like to ask questions. I That's super horror, bro, Mike. Yep, yeah, I. <laughs> you leave it alone. But when you spent as much time in and out of a jug as I have, you learn to keep your mouth shut about things, you know. So when I saw this year out in the newspaper that reads, "Gent Corporation looking for research subjects pays free fifty. That's got to be Mike. I figured it'd be good for me. Easy money, right? With my record, you can't afford to be picky. But it turns out something really wrong is going on in this place. I mean, I've seen dead people before, mm. but here, death is like a way of life, a clockwork march. They wheel out the bodies, and they disappear down the chute. <laughs> Forgotten men from the street, paid to die. Three fifty a week. I love all the, uh, all the cameos. I also don't really know if I am in the right place ever since I fell down, uh, into the void. Okay, wait, so, crouch? Sorry, I'm- <laughs> I'm backtracking just a little bit. Then we go in, get the mic. Audio log. There's a bug flying around me. Then we enter. 
Okay, so <laughs> we're back. I did see I need to find a code somewhere. But I'm not entirely ooh, there's a door. And it's locked, thank god. Where am I supposed to find this code? Unless it was in Mike's audio log, but I don't think it was. I, I didn't see oh 350. Right? If that's it, that's good. You can't put in a one though. I mean a zero. Oh, five, two, three. Damn. I thought for sure it was going to involve the audio log. It would have been cool. Here we go. Where are we headed now? Ooh, this looks interesting. the hell? What are you? What is your purpose? My name is Audrey. I'm not here to cause you any trouble. Look, I just want to go home. Please, can you help me? Is this like the stand-in for the projectionist? I can't quite tell. It doesn't sound like Norman. I'm sure we can reach an agreement. Let's just talk. Who are you? I don't think I like this. They've got a cool voice, though. There's that quote again. Where did you come from? Who made you? Makes sense. Can you take me to him? He wanted me to find him. I don't think that's what he wanted. <laughs> oh god. Here. Oh. You're trying to poison me. Auto save, that's good. Who the hell was that? It's the blob! Just a pencil and a dream. Oh, dude, look at this. Oh, this place is so sick. Boris. I'm still holding out hope that Boris makes an appearance. Uh, 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 excuse me? What, what, what the heck is that? What is that? Ooh. Good thing they don't know I just did that, because I feel like that should have made a loud noise but I don't think they're audio based. Okay, so that just brings me to the other side of the room. Uh oh. Whoa! Uh, 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 um. I just wanted some batteries. Okay, I don't think they follow me up the stairs. No, it doesn't look like it. Oh, okay, that's good. God, they're so creepy. Hmm. So what do I have to do? Do I have to fight them? Defeat them? Crouch under here. Mm, what is this? 
an audio log, but it doesn't look like the traditional audio log. Keeper log number 13. Who's this? Oh. So they experience number 13. So they're sending the ink demon somewhere. And since Wilson wants a detailed report, I'm guessing to make sure that he's fully dead. Because if he's not, I mean, he's been telling people that he is. Are you coming in this room? Oh no. Oh, thank God. I think this door unlocked. <gasps> yes. Mm, literally nothing. Dishy's Cantina. Open that up. Okay, there's one right over there. All right, let's go in dishies. Hmm. Okay. Card exchange. Don't really need that. <gasps> Don't tell me that alerts them. That'd be so bad, and I didn't mean to do that. What's this? What's this? Literally locked. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah, I don't know where to go. There's a lot of different places. I'm gonna go in these vents before I forget. Ooh, I can go up too. Not seeing much besides another audio log. Okay. June 18th, 1971. 36 seconds. Is that what that says? I can't tell. Hmm. All right, let's give this a listen then. Keeper log number 26. Surely there's not that many you can find, right? Oh, that's interesting. All of these efforts have been ultimately unsuccessful. A new method of control must be devised. Termination impossible. So they were not able to terminate the ink demon as per the request of Wilson. And in fact, they couldn't even... Ooh. That's interesting, I can get up there. They, they're they not even able to, like, under undervalue his power. <sighs> Made it. What is out this way? Hopefully something cool, because it's difficult to get to. Hmm. Okay. I wonder if this is where they were storing him for all this time. Locked door. The keepers have taken away my friend, locked him away like some animal just because he's big and strong. But they don't need to fear him, no. If they just make sure to feed him on time, Big Steve won't ever hurt a fly. Big Steve. Where have I heard that name before? Oh, wait. Wasn't there an, um, another letter? I'd have to look. He loves the food from the little... Uh, Devil Lounge, best. If only someone would take the long road trip through the sewers, climb up the elevator shaft, and seek out his favorite thumping delicacy, then they would see how harmless he really is. Hold on, I'm gonna have a look back at the notes. Oh no, here, new job. There is. Hmm, McGregor, and another upgrade. I feel like the ability isn't necessary. At least to upgrade. Like, the cooldown's fine, I can wait, whatever. I'll do... Stay. Just so I can be a bit quicker. Number 44. Wow, they're pumping these out. Experiment 44. We have successfully pressed the ink demon into the form designated as Bendy. He is smaller in size and harmless in this more timid state. His powers are also greatly reduced. Using lengths of steel wire to cut into 
the side of his body. He now registers emotional responses. There were tears of ink documented. Screams of pain. It was delightful to see. It's not delightful to listen to. So they were able to press him down into the form of regular, just like cartoon bendy. And they also tested out experiments of making him feel like emotions, like sadness and pain, which we did see when we harmed him a bit. And honestly, that's probably why he's afraid of us. It's strange though. I do wonder what caused him to become big monster scary again. Ew. Do I have to fight you? I don't think I can. Um. Uh, what the heck do I do? Oh! Don't just kill me outright. At least give me a chance! Oh, do we think that big inky blob monster is the dude who wants food? Doesn't that mean I have to go all the way back to... What, the cafeteria? I'll keep it a stack. I kind of don't want to do that, <laughs> if that's what it's implying. I mean, hopefully, I can come back to this, right? Because I don't want to do it right now. I just kind of want to finish this mission. Because it seems like... We're almost... Uh, past these guys. Okay, so let's head out this way. Hiding spot. Nothing. Okay. Here. Condemned. Effective October 31st, 1952. What the hell was condemned? Cycle breakers. Here we go. Never mind. That's where the ghosts live. Who the Just hell? Beyond that door. The keeper's prison. The pit. <laughs> No one ever comes out. At least, they're never quite the same. But I could open the door for you. I do know how. I really do. Oh, thank mm. you. That would... But, but first, maybe play a game? No. Oh, I love to play games. I like hide and seek best. Find me, and I'll open the door for you. I promise. Look away while I hide, and no peeking. <laughs> Please give me the option to peek, though. Oh, okay. What? I don't care about hide and seek. I, I what, what? Dude, really? Are these guys gonna still be patrolling? They are. What? Really? I genuinely have no clue where I'm supposed to be looking. Oh god. Oh boy. Let's crouch in here. Okay, they lose you pretty easy. I was climbing a ladder! He got me climbing the ladder! Oh. Uh. I heard her. Oh. Uh, hello? I found you. Hello? Oh, you did it! You found me! Oh, this is so exciting! It really wasn't that good of a hiding spot. Now, can you open that door for me? I think you'll find it's open now. Oh, and also, let me give you something. Something special. I don't know if I like this. Just a small reminder of our game together. Eh, yeah, I definitely don't like it. Oh, wait, does that mean I have a new ability? <gasps> Fast travel! Wait, yes, let's go. What was, uh, what was behind is now ahead. Interact with linker pipes to fast travel. That's nice. That should make uh, this dude's cafeteria trip much faster then. Let me try and find... Oh, here we go. Travel. Ah! 
Do I get to pick where I go? Um... I suppose not. This did take me pretty far back, though. Yeah, so it looks like it's only connected between two anchors. Is that what they're called? Linkers. <laughs> oh, it is open. Shouldn't lie. Really? Decontamination. Deep six. Level badge required beyond this point. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Um, so what are we supposed to be doing now? Um. Uh. I'm gonna take that as a projectionist easter egg. If that is, that's really awesome. I don't even mean to do that. That's insane. Alright, gent, 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 gent. What are we supposed to be doing? <laughs> Nothing. Cool. Subject 418. Okay. Hello, Bendy. Death to Bendy. Ooh, hello. What do we have hiding in here? Oh my god. <laughs> no way. That is so awesome. That's really cool. He even follows you. This is so cool! I'm so glad I saw this! Bertram, what the hell are you doing down here, man? At least I know you're not dead anymore. Thought for sure you would have been dead after I beat you up. Do you have any cool audio? No? You don't go, I'm still here. So this seems like it's a, like a relics place. You got Bertram. You got um, the projectionist. What does this do? Subject 414. Excuse me. Sir? Is this Henry? Can you help me? You must be really lost to be asking me for help. Wait. Just is this actually Henry? About the keepers, Wilson, the cycle, anything could help. What's your name? Audrey. What's yours? Honestly, I've almost forgotten. <sighs> My name is Henry. Definitely doesn't look like how I was expecting him to look like. When the keepers think you're a threat to their plans, they lock you away. Forever. Still, it's given me time to think. Things like, if you haven't eaten in years, you might not be human. Why would you be a threat to them? I'm what they call a cycle breaker. Once upon a time, I knew how to start the cycle over. Wow. And when that happens, everything begins again. Completely new. Obviously, Wilson and the Keepers don't want that to happen. How did you do it? Reset the cycle. Turns out the Ink Demon himself is the key. This world is his. But even he must obey its rules. For now, at least. If you can get him to look at something very specific, it will reset the end. everything. What is it? It's just a reel of film, labeled with the words, The End. I can see it in my mind. Wow. Day. They keep it upstairs, in the pit. I'll see if I can break in and steal it. Maybe. If I reset the cycle, we could make things better for everyone here. And what about you? I just want to go home. <laughs> so did I. Oh. Good luck, Audrey. If you need me again, you know where to find me. I wish I could take him along with me. Seeing as Bendy. <laughs> oh! <laughs> what? Seeing as Bendy's abandoned me. I mean, I can't talk to him again. Wow. Okay, so the 414 is a reference to Henry being subject 414. Being trapped in the cycle and finally breaking out. Who's 418? There's a few others, but I don't know if they actually have importance. 
It'd be so cool. Ooh, contraband. Oh, that's clever. That's so clever. <laughs> the axe, the record, the lens. That's great. That's awesome. Okay. Oh my god. Go, go, go. He sensed me talking to Henry. Okay, quickly get a snack. Heal up. Let's save as well. Subject 928. Wow. That's a lot. The pit. Oh boy, here we go. Security lock. Hmm. It is in fact locked. It's a lever. And I guess we shall pull it. What'd that do? That opened the door? It's a pretty obvious lever. <laughs> to a location that you're trying to keep secretive. That. Another body, I guess. Oh, okay, that's just gears. So let's say there's always hope. Oh! Fresh milk? You're having a, a memory of fresh milk. I th we, we are reaching thin. Cartoon of milk for growing up strong and healthy. Add some chocolate for a snack enjoyed by both young and old. Audrey, you are grasping at straws here. That doesn't sound good. Ooh. Don't look this way. Oh, to be fair, I said don't look. Am I dead? Wilson? A savior comes at last. Wilson? Yourself, Audrey. You're still weak. The keepers can be relentless to strangers. But there's nothing to fear as long as I'm with you. You're you heard the thing now. I fear. You did this to me. You brought me here. Turned me into this, this thing. This doesn't make sense. I've never done anything to you. Open your eyes and look around you. None of this makes sense. It's got a point. walls, nightmarish creatures, an ancient studio that died out almost 30 years ago. It's all fiction, utter nonsense. And yet, in here, it exists. It breathes. It flourishes. Reality, guided by its master's pen. The foundation for a new reality. We can what does he have? Into our own. Just think of it. Anything we create in here, we can release. Oh, just think. Out Ew. there. But first, this world must be controlled. Oh, <gasps> Bendy! Made safe. These. These angels and demons. Hi. Are they really life? Don't. Or are they just stains? Old mistakes ready to be cleansed away. I hate you. For newer, greater things. What do you want from me? I need your help to save my father's life you have a father this is our star we'll talk more once we're safely inside um chapter five the dark revival and certainly that's what i'm gonna have to call it for now oh my god the next episode which may just be the final one i don't know maybe it'll be a long chapter there might be two videos uh, apparently will probably be the end i'm very curious where this ending is gonna go 
because I don't know. It's so weird. We have so many more characters. I feel like we've not seen much of yet. I know Alice, Al, like the monster Alice Angels in the game, because she was in the trailer. Ink Demon, I feel like we're probably going to have another boss fight with him. Wilson, I feel like we've got to confront him somehow. Because I doubt, even though he needs our help, we're going to be on his side at the end of it. And they've all got to fit that in one chapter with having a satisfying ending. So, I'm very intrigued. Well, that's going to do it for now. Thank you so much for watching. And I guess I'll see you all next time for the ending of Bendy and the Dark Revival. You're getting a teaser. It wouldn't let me save. Oh, my abilities are gone. I still can't save. Oh my god, what's going on? I just want to save. Oh, no, no, no. Ah, oh, hell not, bro. What is you? No, 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 no. I hate you. Okay, I can save. <laughs>